batting for the Yankees, number two, Derek Jeter, number two. And what we just heard, unbeknownst to you, Derek, was Bob Shepard introducing you, Derek Jeter, number two. We're going to be hearing that for three more years, at least at Yankee Stadium. How do you feel about that? I feel good. You know, I've said that since day one. This is the only organization I want to play for. And, uh, you know, I'm happy that, you know, you can't even, like I said earlier, you can't even say I'm back because I didn't go anywhere. But um, I'm happy that I have an opportunity to, uh, this is another step in that direction. Derek, we all know how private you are, and in your press conference just now, you talked about how some of the process bothered you a little bit. Take us through your thought process as the negotiation was going on. What were you thinking? Well, I think, you know, I've never been in this situation before. Uh, you know, I didn't want to be a free agent. You know, I, I said that before, but obviously this is this is how it how it went. Uh, from my understanding, it was supposed to be a private negotiation. Um, that wasn't the case. So, yeah, I was angry at some things that got now, especially how things were portrayed because uh, my understanding it was a negotiation. And, you know, you hear so many things that my salary demands and what I uh, said you had to give me and all these numbers that were thrown out there that all of them were pretty much inaccurate. So I think it's just how I was portrayed. It, it made me pretty angry. As you look now and, you, as Bob said, you've got three years in front of you. You have the player option for the fourth year. What's ahead of you? We have 3,000 hits. You already have the five World Series rings. What are the kind of things, goals, expectations that you have for yourself? Well, you know, Jack, you know me as well as anyone. And the bottom line is, is I'm trying to win. You know, that's what we're trying to do. That's why you play the games. And, uh, you know, that, that will never never go my 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 focus will never go uh, on anything personal it, it's basically what we can do try to improve and then get better and that's how it's always been Derek as you went through this process did you view it at all as well I've got to look at this as my last contract were you and Casey close your agent talking about that how did you view it uh, well that's Casey's job you know my job is to play uh, you know I never like I said before I, I can't tell the future I'm going to play as long as I'm having fun. I'm having a good time now playing. I'm enjoying myself. But, no, it was never a situation where I view this as being my last contract. I mean, whoever, who knows, but I uh, hope not. You know, you're coming off a season in which you didn't have a typical Derek Jeter year. You've certainly heard a lot of people weigh in on what kind of season they thought you had. What kind of season do you think you had, and how do you view it? We had a poor one. We lost. You know, that's the bottom line, uh, myself included. You know, I didn't play up to the expectation level that I have. And, uh, you know, I work hard so that doesn't happen again. Again. But, um, you know, I guess you play this game long enough, you're bound to have a bad year. And, uh, you know, if that's my bad year, I'll take it all the time. We know that there was a meeting a week ago where you guys had a four-hour meeting, sat across from each other, and just kind of reiterated how much you wanted to be a Yankee and how much the Yankees wanted you. How much kind of a, did that help in getting negotiations pushing forward? See, that's where all these reports come, four-hour meeting. You really think I was in a meeting for four hours? <laughs> no, I wasn't in a meeting for four hours. Um, you know, I don't want to get into any specifics. Uh, you know, I've let everyone know. I let the world know. This is the only team I want to play for, and, and that's the bottom line. And, uh, you know, ownership knows that, and you know, I just let that be known once again. But you had to get creative with the contract as well. Was that fourth year important to you to be able to have the ability to say, after these three years, if I feel like I want that option to play a fourth year, was that important? Yeah, no question. I mean, yeah, I'd like to. You know, one of the luxuries I had with the last deal I signed, it was so long, I never had to answer these questions. And, you know, I didn't like this situation. Um, probably I don't want to be in it again. So, yeah, obviously the longer the better. But it's a situation where I have to go out and I have to play well. You know, I guess ultimately Yankees fans want to know at the end of this entire process and everything that they've read because they weren't on the inside, is Derek Jeter happy with where he's at right now and with the deal that he's yeah, got? No question. I mean, I wouldn't sign a deal if I wasn't happy. I mean, yeah, there's things that go back and forth. I think that's that's a part of it. But, uh, no, I mean, it, this is the only organization I wanted to play for, and, and the only thing that would have made me upset is if I wasn't, wasn't back. Did these negotiations boil down to, to Derek, that Derek Jeter needed the Yankees and the Yankees needed Derek Jeter? I think most people around baseball couldn't see you and the Yankees being separate from each other. Well, I don't think they should have had to try to envision that because I told them. You know, I pretty much let it be known. I, I can't stress that enough that this is the only place I wanted to go. And, and if other teams called Casey, I told Casey I didn't want to hear about it. You know, this, this is it. So, yeah, I mean, uh, of course, I need the Yankees and I'd like to think they need me as well. Derek, we're going to let you go. One thing we did learn about Derek, Jack, not a big four-hour meeting guy. So <laughs> Didn't want to be there. I'm in and Two out. hours, two and a half? I'm in and out. Derek, thanks. Congratulations. No, no Thank Appreciate you. the Thank time. Thank you very much.